Satch, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. Today we are going to get some important messages for you. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. All right, Satch, spirits and angels, please show me important general messages for Sagittarius today. I see you getting what you want. I see you getting your way, okay, Satch? Nine of Cups, um, this is today's reading, but uh, it's a timeless reading. This can apply right now or in the near, near future, okay? So Nine of Cups, I see you finally uh, getting what you want, even though whatever you want or whatever you wanted uh, in the past, it could have broken your heart here with the Three of Swords and the Knight of Swords, okay? For some of you, it's that talk, okay? Something about you or somebody wanting to talk to you, you wanting to talk to somebody, judgment here, hashing things out. Uh, and also, we've got the Chariot in reverse and the Queen of Wands here. It feels a little bit like with this Queen of Wands, this is you, right? This is your energy fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. You're looking towards the future. Um, and Nine of Cups is sort of like, I don't know, Satch. I just feel like the sun here in what first can indicate somebody being really unhappy, okay? Uh, and the hermit here in what first could be realizing or coming out of their um, coming out of their isolation here with the Knight of Wands and what first. Oh my gosh, I just feel like Satch. Somebody could be receiving their really bad karma with the judgment here. Not you, but the other person, okay? Because Nine of Cups is here and the Queen of Wands is here. So you're happy or that you are going to be happy to hear something about somebody who may have made you really unhappy, put you in the hermit mode where you you had to reflect on things. And, you know, um, in the Nine of Wands, remember, is this person either could have lied, cheated on you or didn't quite stick around or wasn't being honest. Um, the judgment here and the cherry in reverse i feel like this is a karma card something that was going on with somebody this person who may have mistreated you broken your heart through a sword you made you really sad i'm seeing you hearing about this person either not doing well or something 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 is happening or something something will be happening to them that is going to make them very unhappy but make you very happy <laughs> nine of cups here you're like, yes, I've been waiting for this moment. So sad, you've been waiting for this moment and feels like again, nine of cups, your wish is going to be fulfilled. You're gonna see this person really unhappy and you also see this person being really uh, sad and angry, okay? And that whatever they've been planning to move forward is not going to happen or will be delayed because it's in love first, right? Let's see more, Satch. Again, this can be anybody, right, Satch? It could be a friend, it could be an ex, or it could be an enemy. Nine of Pentacles here is in reverse. We've got the Magician here, and the Tower, and the King of Swords. Yeah, I feel like somebody is going to be exposed, okay? Somebody who may have treated you, again, unfairly here, made you really sad, unhappy. I feel like this person is receiving their karma. And again, the Tower here feels like it's a surprise, okay? You'll be quite shocked to hear it, but at the same time, you will be very happy, okay? Because the Magician and the King of Swords here in verse, somebody will be exposed for either lying or that being, being deceptive with the Magician here. And oh, for some of you, Satch, I don't know who is doing this right now. Some of you, if you're into magic, black magic, uh, I sense another thing I'm getting here. If you're into black magic and things like that, if you have cast a spell on a certain someone, or I don't know who, but I feel like you're gonna be quite shocked with the tower and the magician here that your spell actually is working or worked, okay? That's just for some of you, Satch, if you do these things. And Nine of Pentacles here is in reverse. We've got the Nine of Wands and also we've got the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Hmm. 
Another thing I'm seeing here is that this person will either be losing money or losing a relationship. And um, maybe that person will break up with somebody or losing money or losing a job. And Nine of Wands and this person, you are going to find out, or some of you maybe have already found out, like this person is going to get hurt, right? And the Ace of Pentacles here is in reverse. It could also be hurt in a way, it could be physically as well. Yeah, I hate to say this. Um, physically hurt or it could be, you know, because a relationship has ended or it could be losing money, nine of pentacles and one first. But the nine of wands is upright position. So if they are physically hurt, I don't see them dying or anything. Okay, it's still standing up. I see like it's just a minor, minor, um, minor thing. Yeah. Uh, we've got the ace of pentacles here and reverse as well. Hmm. It feels like, again, this person is losing an opportunity or losing money, losing a relationship or gotten hurt here with the Nine of Wands. Could be physically, yeah. But I feel like with the Nine of Cups and the Queen of Wands, again, such this is what... If you don't want this to happen to this person, then this story is not yours. This reading is not yours. But I feel like some of you here, Satch, and this is very specific. If this, if this is what you want with this person, uh, to you know, this person to be uh, become unlucky or <laughs> like um, going through a lot of mishaps or wow, it's just crazy, right, Satch? The way I look at this. The spread here, I feel like you're gonna be very happy again with the Queen of Wands. It's like, yes, this person finally received their bad karma here with the judgment here. And with the Queen of Wands, you're going to feel so much better, right? <laughs> so much better or so much more powerful. I don't know, Sash. I hope this is not what somebody's trying to do to you, okay? Again, it could go vice versa. So I hope this is not somebody is trying to do to you, trying to hurt you, okay? Whether it is to defame you, judgment can talk about bringing things up from the past that is uh, not too pretty, that's kind of ugly, okay? So if this is somebody trying to do this to you, Satch, then you should protect yourself, okay? And we've got the Strength card here, Two of Pentacles, and then we've got the Eight of Pentacles here. Some of you have see you working really hard or that Two of Pentacles can be... You, could, you may have a lot on your plate right now. Very, very busy. I see a lot of you are being very busy, but the strength card here indicates that no matter how busy you are or how much responsibilities that you have right now, the strength card indicates you trying to be patient, trying to be uh, to deal with it very tactfully, very or diplomatically, okay? You're a very strong strength card here, uh, Saj. You're very, very strong. Even though you've got a lot, again, on your plate, Eight of Pentacles, you just, you just keep doing whatever you are doing, okay? But I see, you know, with Eight of Pentacles, of course, eventually, eventually it will be, I, I think it will pay off, okay? Ten of Swords is here, Five Cups in Reverse. We've got the King of Cups in Reverse. I see also for some of you, Saj, if you're dealing with someone who may have hurt you in the past, this person is going to try and express to you yeah, about how they feel about you, but they could be holding back. They could be distracting themselves by working really hard, Eight of Pentacles, or it could be you as well, Saj, could be working really hard trying to distract yourself from some hurt and pain from a certain individual here with the Ten of Swords and the Five of Cups. A Ten of Pentacles is right here, the star, and we've got Eight of Wands. Something is happening pretty soon, but they are good news, okay? The star and the Ten of Pentacles for me may indicate for those of you if you've been wishing also for a reconciliation. I see that happening pretty soon, perhaps within 10 days or 10 weeks. But um, Ten of Pentacles also can indicate if this is your wish to get married to someone, be married to somebody. Or to start a new family or to adopt children or to buy a house buy a car i see that happening as well and ten of pentacles also sometimes can indicate some sort of inheritance so some of you be good news in regards of you know somebody giving you money you're getting inherited like a house a car or money something that is valuable okay 
and the star here again indicates your wishes are going to come true you have two cards that indicates your wishes are going to come true okay whether it's good or if it's bad so make sure you don't wish um bad things sometimes i don't know don't say bad things about yourself okay only say good things about yourself because um, good or bad it might just come true but again this part of the the beginning of the reading was kind of i feel specific again it's not gonna apply to you but you know ten of pentacles a lot of abundance coming in for you guys you're gonna make a lot of money eight of pentacles here your your hard work is gonna pay off for sure the star you may gain recognition as well from your hard work and eight of ones here or somebody c close with you could be recognizing your effort okay your the effort that you could be putting in maybe in the relationship and taking care of your house ten of pentacles can indicate that or taking care of your child or children somebody saying kind words to you uh, very loving words towards you could also indicate support here i feel like such for some of you getting all the support that you can get from your friends or family and um, for some of you it's you know taking care of a baby a newborn baby or support in your career or buying a home hmm. all right such this is your reading i hope you resonated it in some way shape or form obviously you know it's a general reading you're not gonna resonate all the way through from the beginning till the end but i hope you do if you did please hit like share and subscribe and i'm gonna leave you with a video on the screen right now this video has i uh, know this video is my latest video from my second travel vlog channel i just posted it three days ago it has um in in this video uh, i went to the marcus beach i had so much fun um, I'm at Trinidad and Tobago now and I tried Big and Shark for the first time. It's a very fun video. Just check it out if you want to. If not, it's fine too. And, I'll, and also I'm going to leave you with a video, uh, sorry, a playlist on the screen. This playlist has all of the readings I've done for you for the rest of the signs with different topics, different questions. Um, but they're still new, so they're still valid, okay? Uh, with different topic, different questions. Again, check it out if you want to Saj and also I'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below and if you'd like to be notified every time I post your videos don't forget to hit on the bell notification button all right take care Saj bye